Okay, uh, guys, guys welcome, welcome to game, game number 10, ten of Tomb of Annihilation. And, uh, uh just, just a, a quick, quick recap, recap from the last session, um, you, you met, met the lobster, lobster people. people. Uh, you, you threw chickens, chickens to them. Uh, you, you don't, don't know, know if they ate them or not. Uh, you, you did manage to bypass them without a fight. Uh, you, you met, met a crocodile. Undril got attacked and drug into the water. You, after saving her, you set up camp and encountered a group of skeletons and found a wand of wonder. Yep. And once again, uh, that had five or six charges per day. And unless you uh, run out of charges during the day, uh, it regenerates uh, one to five charges per day. So you're always safe to use one, but if you use more than one, <laughs> you don't know. Uh, yeah, if, 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 if you use... Uh, if, if you use all five or six charges in a day, you roll a 20-sided, and if the result is a one, oh, is this a one uh, the wand disintegrates. And it is now uh, the morning of the day number 20... Seven, and in, in the, the jungle. jungle. <laughs> okay. And you all were working your way south, uh, headed towards Omo. All right. Okay, I'm having an issue here with front of the ground. You get the crash. Give me a second. Ah, no, no problem. problem. I tried to load the user manual to see my my self, but just uh, Okay. I guess I have to close. Huh, I see you in mine. Yeah, yeah, I, I just, just got, got the... Uh, uh, oh, uh, yeah, yeah, we're, we're, we're good. good. It's, it's not, not a problem, problem at all. Uh, so, so it's, it's a, a uh, typical, typical day in the jungle, another hot and humid. Uh, fortunately, there's no sign of rain. Well, I'm sure our cat guides are happy about that. Oh, oh absolutely. absolutely. Big, Big or small, small they, they hate water. <laughs> and, you know, you know being, being, being in the swamp land and so forth, they're, they're just, just not happy anyway. Let's see, I think we were pushing on towards somewhere, but I forget what it was off the top of my head. Or ahead. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, give me a second, second. I'll, I'll reshare the map. map. And jolt. jolt. And that's the wrong one. one. Yeah, yeah, you're um, <coughs> you're, you're headed, headed over towards the um, the this floating mountain island, island that, that you see. see. Yeah, we're heading to the floating mountain. <laughs> yeah. 
He's gonna be on the river, right in the bank of the river. Uh, uh, yes, uh, you, you were going, going down, down the river, river and, and I believe you were going, going to have to cross. And, and fortunately, it's not, not too, too much out, out of your way headed toward Omo. And, gentlemen, I, you, you, everyone, everyone in the group paddles, paddles hard today, and you, you do, uh, about, about two o'clock in, in the afternoon, afternoon uh, you, you come, come upon, the, the, the river, river turns into a, a, you know, you know small, small, small sized, sized lake. lake. And, and you, you start, start paddling, paddling over, over toward the, the uh, the, the shoreline, shore line. and you make, you make it, it with no problem. problem. And from, from here, uh, you uh, get, get to, to the floating, floating island. island. You, you have, have to um, get, get out and start, start walking. walking. <laughs> okay, we're getting closer and closer. Uh, uh, yes, yes, and. and uh, unfortunately, your next five miles are going to be horrible because you are indeed walking through the middle of the marshland and so forth, and there's weeds and reeds and all kinds of things in the marsh, and you're able to press on that by the, the evening, evening time, uh, uh, you, you actually make, make landfall. Uh, uh, you're, you're back, back on solid, solid dry ground. ground. <laughs> well, that's good. And <clears throat> if everyone's uh, wet tired and you all decide to set up camp okay let's get some firewood get everything going Yeah, so, so gotta, gotta remember, remember to turn, turn on image, image layers. <laughs> and you got the tent set up and you got your campfire. <laughs> and as you are setting up um, camp and you know everyone's gone about their business and so forth and Mr. Happy's probably warming himself by the fire. <laughs> Where would you two guys like to go? Like on the map? Yes. yes. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, sorry. We're, we're back, back on, on the marsh, marsh map. map. Yeah. yeah. If there's some help with my character's now wrong uh, scratch, please uh, feel free to move because I can't see it. Due to the resolution here, can't see the lines very well. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's not, not a problem. I pulled up a map the other day, put the grid on it, and you could not see it at all. It's like, like, nope, that, that one ain't gonna work. Chemo <laughs> is kind of echoing a little. Or he was. I am? Yeah, a little bit. I'm sort of hearing myself, too, a little. Yeah, I can't hear you twice. What about now? Testing? Better now? 
Yeah, a little bit. Trying a new headset out today. It sounds like I'm hearing myself. Uh, right now, you very well could have been. <laughs> uh, so, anyway, as you're setting up camp, um, to the northwest of you, uh, you become aware of motion in the woods. On the wood, like big motion or small motion? Uh, big motion. Okay, guys, what should we do? Well, we could try hiding again. So, why don't we hide behind some trees? And I'll. Can I do like a minor illusion that looks like us by the fire? Yeah, let's try that. Yeah, you sure can. This looks like a good tree spot over here. <laughs> Let's see, Mo. Mr. Happy, flask of wine would move down. So you're going to cast an illusion that you're all still around the fire while hiding at the tree. Yeah. Okay, and you see <laughs> this really ugly creature. Oh. And he comes down and it sees your all's illusion around the campfire. And your illusion would just be you all concentrating, watching on the campfire, correct? Yep, just sitting there. And, you know, he comes down and he growls and uh, he runs over to, you know, the river misk and flask and undrill, I believe we're at the top of the uh, campfire and, you know, he swipes out at him and they don't respond and you know he's a little confused about it so he tries it again and he is just truly confused you know his hands just passing through the illusion and you know he comes around and he swings at another party member and just it, it's not happening and in anger you know he comes over and he's starts tearing up the tent and wrecking the camp and you know kicks crap into the fire and your illusions still are not reacting then would you all like to uh, make your stealth checks <laughs> okay okay Uh, 
Uh, uh, uh, yeah, you you had a very 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 bad roll. <laughs> I knew that this would happen. Uh, and yeah, suddenly the troll is uh, looking towards the tree, and now would be a good time to roll for initiative. Well, yeah, it was definitely better than your stealth check. <laughs> <laughs> and guys, uh, I'm not sure if I gave you one last time, so we'll start this with the overnight rest. And then I'll put you back into initiative. Malik was nine. Hema was four. Oh, and the troll is up first. <laughs> and let's see. And Hemo, he comes down. Three, five, ten. And unfortunately, he can't get to you this round. Uh, he is a large creature, but he does not have reach. Oh, all right. And flask of wine's gonna run up here. Tries to shoot him with a short bow and does indeed hit. And the troll roars out in pain. Let's see, each square is it like five feet? Yeah. Okay, looks like I'm in range for Witch Bolt. All right, lightning starts hitting him. Okay, River Mist is uh, going to come up and around and fires her short bow and it lands into the tree. Andrew comes up and she's going to start with the sacred flame and he fails his saving throw and takes minimal damage. What a waste. Mr. Happy! He's going to try to scare the troll.
and he failed on his will save. And Hemo, you are up, sir. Huh. I don't hear him. Can you hear me? Oh, there he is. Okay. So I was, out, I was talking without talking a bit. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm targeting this row and I will row um, funny hand to the second level. Oh, and he succeeded. <laughs> so he takes half, half of them again. Yes, sir. Okay, then. Uh, um, so I'm not in reach, right? So I can move. With Correct. Even, uh, I can't move towards the scary amp or closet. <laughs> I will move back around the, the guide. That was a smart move. <laughs> okay, and... Let's see. He is scared of Mr. Happy. I have one question. Um, yes. So I know I know that every round the oh, uh, he gained ten um, things, but I guess they did not regain against uh, fire and acid, right? Uh, correct. If I remember correct. But and then, but my bunny rent the fact that it is not that he succeeds means that like the entire damage because because I would imagine that if he had got half damage fire he should not uh, recover that. But I don't know if a any fire damage isn't recoverable with a troll. So maybe I have to con uh, do something here in my other. Uh, let's see. Because it was automatically healed him, right? Uh, it could be because in your burning hand spell under type, uh, try making fire all lowercase. Alright, second. Alright, now I... All, all lowercase. Yes. Oh yeah, you're right. That might be the case. Okay, now the next time, I hope we're not pick it up. Okay, uh, he is not going to move towards Mr. Happy, and he is currently being struck by lightning from Malik. So. Yeah. He is moving away from Mr. Happy. Oh, uh, Mr. Happy get an opportunity attack on him? And, yes, Mr. Happy would get an opportunity attack. And... Mr. Happy hits the troll. And the troll is poisoned. Get attack, Mr. Happy. And Aha. Um, Malik, uh, initially he tries to bite you. Ouch. 
and uh, you got lucky because uh, having disadvantage from being poisoned, <laughs> it dropped the crit. <laughs> and you take some damage. Flask of wine. It's going to come over and try to attack with the short bow. Manages to get a crit. And Malik, you have a pissed off troll in front of you. Now, uh, bonus action, does that break concentration? Uh, I think I would misty step. Uh, yeah, I'd say misty step would break concentration. Okay. So I'll go over there. And then I'll chill touch the troll. Okay, River Mist is going to take a five foot step and no, nope, he missed. Uh, Undrill. She is going to do the guiding bolt. And hits the troll. Mr. Happy. Charge. Charge. Sure. Okay. And he misses the troll. Hemo. I can move, right? Yes, sir. Alright, so I will move here. And then I will target the troll again. And then I will press... Um... <coughs> bunny hands again. That was a good damage. Then I move again back. I did something wrong here. And my turn is. Can you oh. allow my movement? That would be two moves, wouldn't it? Uh, well, he didn't take his uh, full movement, so he can. Uh, 5e allows you to do a half movement, do your action, and then resume your movement. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, exactly. If you're a weak wizard, without much HP. Absolutely. And let's see, ooh, who's next? The troll. And... Okay, well, the troll knows that he's getting hit by magic users, and he is moving away from Mr. Happy. 
and he's going to come up and Andro is first in his way so he tries to bite her and he does not bite her and then he swings at a claw and that's a miss as well I hate this poison shit <laughs> And that is a hit on Andro with the claw. And she takes 11 points of damage. Flask of Wine is uh, going to come down. And takes another short bow attack. Does hit the troll. Malik. Oh, she'll touch the troll again. If only you could make it look like Undril did it. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> and Ripper Mist is going to fire the short bow. Gets a hit. Andrew's going to do the guiding bolt again. Oh, and she misses. And she is going to disengage. And come back a few feet. Mr. Happy, charge. Yeah. And... Mr. Happy swings and it's a miss. Okay. So, um, let me see. I guess I will go with uh, Chromatic Orb of Fire. Let me see. Bring it on, buddy. <laughs> I've killed you once, I can kill you again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and I miss. They're gonna move. Far, far away. <laughs> Behind the guide and <laughs> and <our> our <laughs> Is it all right? Well, you know, Malik, um, he's gonna come up. Is Happy get another swipe? <laughs> uh, you know, I'll give Happy a swipe. Oh, uh, well. And now, you know, the troll, he's going to take his bite and, wow, hit you. <laughs> Ouch. Was not expecting that. And then he's going to take his two claw attacks. And that one did not. And the other one. Nope. A uh, flask of wine is going to move up. Malik. Oh, uh, Misty Step again. And then she'll touch the troll. Uh, Ripper Mist is like, oh shit. <laughs> and she lets loose, and oh shit again, she misses, and she is pulling back. Let 
let's see. And she's going to try her sacred flame again. Oh, uh, wait, he succeeded on that, so he wouldn't take the damage. Mr. Happy. Charging again. <laughs> moves in for the attack, and the third time is a charm. And Hemo. Alright, so I will move a bit. Get into the range of uh, Bunny Rand again. And then we call Bunny Rand to the first level. Bed. And then I will step back again. Okay. And that would be ninety seven. I guess he got the heal again. Uh, yeah, I, I caught it and uh, adjusted. Okay, okay, cool, thank you. Yeah, uh, when you apply your damage, it, it's bypassing the DR. Oh, uh, alright. At least the poison is nerfing his regeneration. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And, okay, the troll... Okay, well, he's pretty upset with Mr. Happy, and he hits Mr. Happy. And then he swings his claws at Mr. Happy. Flask of wine comes up and shoots the short bow. Does hit the troll. Okay, I'm gonna use chill touch again. Alright. And River Mist is going to come up and take a shot. And Andrel's like, you know, I've just had it. And she walks up and swings her mace at the troll and unfortunately misses. <laughs> uh, happy attacks again. Nope. <laughs> Hemo. Alright. So I will I will go with uh 
Make it a firebolt. Yep. I'm going to take the alchemy judge jug and cut off the limbs and pour the pour have it uh, pour acid over the stumps. Okay. And then I'm going to make like a little muzzle for the troll. And guys, I host connection lost. Uh uh, yeah, uh, unfortunately, Fantasy Grounds just crashed on my end. Yeah, I got kicked too. But anyway, eh. so I'm uh, acid burning the, the limbs way. off the troll and making a little muzzle. And now we got infinite troll meat to go with our infinite water with the jug. You got infinite troll meat? <laughs> <laughs> you think correct? Uh, uh, yeah, with the alchemy jug, he's putting the troll meat into the jug, so you have an infinite supply of meat if you want it. <laughs> yeah, I'm burning the limbs off, so we have like troll meat, since it can't do anything muzzled and with its limbs acid burned off. All right. Okay. <laughs> That's very good. That's very really good. Now we don't have to worry about rations anymore. As long as you like troll. <laughs> Put some seasoning on it. Yeah. And guys, you should be able to reconnect now. All right, gonna... Uh, it's still some couldn't connect a host. Maybe I'll exit. <laughs>